Nearly every child in the world gets infected with rotavirus by age three. The diarrhea it causes can result in severe dehydration and death. More than 85% of the deaths from this virus occur in Asian and African countries. As many as two million children are hospitalized each year because of rotavirus infections. The younger a child is, the more life-threatening the infection can be, which is why an oral vaccine is given to babies. We're going to do rotavirus. Okay. That's a little drink. That's a little drink. Babies normally get two or three doses, starting when they're two months old. Job, Several years ago, a rotavirus vaccine was taken off the market because it increased a baby's risk of developing a rare but potentially deadly intestinal blockage. Other vaccines have since taken its place, but a manufacturer's study of one of them, the Rotatech vaccine, suggested that it too might cause intestinal blockage after the first dose. Epidemiologist Irene Shui at the Harvard School of Public Health decided to investigate. Because the rotavirus vaccine is given to almost every child in the United States, it's crucial to monitor the vaccine's safety. Shui and other researchers examined the records of almost 800,000 babies who received this vaccine, including 300,000 first doses. They were looking for incidents of intussusception, the medical term for this kind of blockage. We did not find an elevated risk of intussusception following any dose of the vaccine, and especially following the first dose of the vaccine. Shui says even though the intestinal blockage is rare, it's important to continue to monitor these vaccines with additional studies like hers. And she notes that the World Health Organization recommends the vaccine be included in all infant immunization programs. The benefits from rotavirus vaccine in terms of reducing the number of hospitalizations and deaths from rotavirus disease far outweigh the potential risk of intussusception that might exist. Thank you, Angel. Aren't you doing great? In the U.S., according to the Centers for Disease Control, the vaccines are up to 98 percent effective in preventing severe rotavirus disease in infants and young children. Carol Pearson, VOA News.